they put modern animals to shame. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 prehistoric animals. Hundreds of teeth capable of inflicting terrible damage on its prey. A jaw three meters wide and two meters high. For this list, we're looking at the coolest animals that lived before written history. Every type of animal is eligible, from dinosaurs to fish to mammals, as long as they're extinct and prehistoric. The entries are ranked by how renowned, interesting, and impressive they were, with an emphasis on notoriety. Welcome to Jurassic Park. Number 10, Estemenosuchus. Though not recognizable to humans, Estemenosuchus must have been a celebrity among its prehistoric brethren. Its cubone-like appearance would have made it memorable. With a name that means crowned crocodile, which conjures a rough idea of its appearance, the Estemenosuchus predated dinosaurs, meaning we don't have a lot of information on the animal, and what we do have is strangely ambiguous. Its body could extend to more than 10 feet long with a 26-inch long head, an imposing sight even without the antler-like horns. What's more, the Estemenosuchus was also said to have been an omnivore, though some experts peg it as more of a plant-eating creature. So while its true identity remains a mystery, at least we can say it looks like a Pokémon. Number 9. Liopleurodon you think the ocean's scary now? Try living in the Jurassic period when its aquatic inhabitants were true sea monsters. Liplorodon. At 150 tons, it is the largest and most powerful carnivore ever to live on the planet. The ruler of the seas was Liopleurodon, a short-necked pleosaur with a four-foot skull and an intimidating set of jaws. Liopleurodon was originally thought to be 80 feet long, given the size of individual bones, but this was redacted when a more accurate and conservative estimate of 16 to 23 feet was announced. But even so, this does little to curb our fear. That is colossal, and I'm sure this is Liopleurodon. The T-Rex of the ocean, an apex predator with an appetite for flesh and bone, Liopleurodon is an underrated killer. Liopleurodon are fiercely territorial about their hunting areas, and confrontations almost always end in violence. Number 8. Triceratops It was the vegetarian king of the dinosaurs. Despite no carnivorous appetite, Triceratops was built like an armored tank, capable of overpowering the most ferocious dinosaur adversaries. They had this big, massive body with a big gut. Uh, so, you know, we're talking of an animal that's maybe four or five tons. In museum recreations, the battles between Triceratops and T-Rex were the Ali Frasers of the Cretaceous period. If there's an animal whose scent would frighten a T-Rex, it's Triceratops. In real life, it's debatable just how epic and frequent these clashes were, but it's clear that Triceratops was not an easy prey for the big guy. Its horns were once thought to be a means of defense, used to assert authority. Triceratops was one of the last dinosaurs to go extinct, outliving several species that came before it. It's clear that Triceratops' vegetarian lifestyle did not make it any less of a survivor. Triceratops is heavily armed and heavily armored and can kill you. Number 7. Smilodon, also known as the saber-toothed tiger. For a second there, I actually thought you were going to eat me. I don't eat junk food. An apex predator supreme. These animals were only distantly related to tigers and are definitely one of the more recognizable ferocious beasts on this list. They had a thick, muscular body, a large jaw, and long, protruding canines that were ready for the kill. Their serrated teeth were like little steak knives, ideal for scavenging after mum had made the kill. With the help of their signature 11-inch weapons, Smilodon hunted and impaled animals of all shapes and sizes, including giant bison, mammoths, and ground sloths. Smilodon is also the largest known feline to have ever lived, tipping the scales at almost 900 pounds and possibly over 1,000. They reigned for 2 million years before dying out in 10,000 BC. Number 6. Spinosaurus Spinosaurus. At 17 meters, the biggest killer ever to walk the Earth. Despite the notoriety of predatory dinosaurs like T. rex, Allosaurus and Albertosaurus, none was larger or more terrifying than Spinosaurus. Ah! 
Estimates place its size at up to 60 feet long and almost 21 tons, which would make Spinosaurus the largest predatory dinosaur. In fact, the 40-foot, 10-ton T-Rex, you know, the supposed king of the dinosaurs, looks like a child next to this killing machine. Size aside, its features were doubly unsettling. With a head like a crocodile, spinal vertebrae that made a giant sail on its back, and a bevy of specialized teeth, Spinosaurus hunted on land and in water as it pleased. It dominated for millions of years before dying in the Cenomanian extinction. Well, I think Spinosaurus is ready now to occupy its space in the, in the pantheon of dinosaurs. Number 5. Titanoboa To reflect its ancestry, as well as its enormity, it will be called Titanoboa, a boa of titanic proportions. Ophidiophobics, that is, those who fear snakes, beware. Snakes. Why did it have to be snakes? Titanoboa could make an anaconda look like a garter snake. At 42 feet, Titanoboa was twice as long as the reticulated pythons we currently have slithering around, and almost 12 times heavier than the green anaconda, the largest snake living today. This one-ton serpent lived in the period that succeeded the dinosaurs, and though it was considered an apex predator, preying on gigantic reptilian contemporaries like turtles and crocodiles, it's now thought to have primarily feasted on fish. In 2009, several vertebrae of the Titanoboa were found in a South American mine, giving us a much better idea of their magnitude. The vertebrae indicates a snake vastly bigger than any snake today. So big, that it stretches the entire length of the lab. Number 4. Paraceratherium 30 million years ago, there existed a land animal that would put the largest African elephant to shame. Paraceratherium was a hornless rhinoceros that could grow to almost 24 and a half feet long and up to 16 feet high at its shoulders, with its weight reaching up to 20 tons. To put that in perspective, some giraffes, necks and all, would barely clear its shoulders, and the biggest elephant wouldn't even crack 8 tons. Though considered by many to be the largest terrestrial mammal ever to have lived, Paraceratherium was an herbivore with no anatomical weapons save its size, leaving a comparatively gentle giant who could, but probably wouldn't, stomp most creatures to death. Number 3. Woolly Mammoth <laughs> Of all the prehistoric mammals, none is more iconic than the woolly mammoth. Living during the Pleistocene period, these large hairy elephants populated the northern hemisphere, with a presence indicating strong biodiversity. Mammoths helped further the development of humanity, with every piece being used as material for either food, clothing, or shelter. The woolly mammoth is also renowned for its imperishability, since the Wrangell Island population lived till 4,000 years ago. For context, that means there were mammoths living long after the pyramids were built. And since there's been a tremendous amount of organic material originating from mammoths found preserved in ice, mammoths remain a prime candidate for cloning. Get ready for Mammoth Park. George's team of bright young geneticists is already working on modifying the elephant genome. Number 2. Megalodon You're gonna need a bigger boat. You're definitely gonna need a bigger boat for this beast. Imagine a shark larger than a whale, and you have just begun to breach the surface of this horrifying apparition. Perhaps the best indication of its nearly incomprehensible size is the dimensions of its mouth. At 9 feet high and 11 feet wide, Megalodon's mouth would have little problem engulfing a school bus. It was also lined with 7-inch teeth, which worked to produce a bite force of 20 US tons per square inch. Behind the 46 teeth in the front row, Approximately 200 more teeth lie in rows, waiting to flip forward to the front and take their place on the predatory battlefield. Megalodon was similar in appearance to a great white shark, but three times as large. And considering its combination of size and power, it may be the greatest predator in Earth's history. If the Megalodon spotted a Squalodon, it wouldn't have hesitated to attack. Before we unveil our number one pick, here are some honorable mentions. But to bring down a camel, it would also have to run fast. This world belonged to a buzzsaw killer the size of a great white, but they got a lot bigger than that. By reconstructing all the evidence that we have gathered from the fossil bones, we can now reveal Velociraptor 
at its most ruthless. And there it was, the long streamlined shape. This had to be Bacillosaurus. Number one, Tyrannosaurus Rex. Get the kid! It is the undisputed king of the dinosaurs, both in name and reputation, as Tyrannosaurus rex literally means tyrant lizard king. Since the first Tyrannosaurus remains were uncovered in 1874, people have been fascinated by this dynamic creature, which has popped up time and time again in every form of media. Fossil recreations of its skeleton are always among the most popular part of any museum. With its undeniably fierce appearance and demonstrated skill as a predator, its popularity proves that human beings love being scared. <laughs> T-Rex also turned the spotlight on theropod dinosaurs, the bipedal giants that include the Utah Raptor, Gigantosaurus, and Allosaurus. And while those guys have been worthy challengers to its notoriety, T-Rex will never be dethroned. <laughs> Do you agree with our list? What's your favorite prehistoric animal? Then an ankylosaur was more like a prehistoric cow. For more top 10s published every day, be sure to subscribe to watchmojo.com.